What's up, YouTube? It's Chef coming from the Gundam Kitchen. It's been a little bit been kind of slow, especially with the Gundam shipments. But we're getting back there. My one distributor where I get most of my stuff from. Finally getting our act together. We will have a very big shipment with some new stuff in it next week. And probably one right after that. So we might even get two next week. Which is good because we have the potluck on Saturday. So definitely make it out for that. Should be pretty stocked up by then. But as you can see, got a couple good MGs back in. Got that Hama Hama in. This is a word you gotta say, Hama Hama. Nice SDs, some of the old school ones. Of course, we're waiting for those new ones to come out with the uh, frames. That's gonna be exciting. Couple high grades. Full armor uh, gun on the seventh. If you don't know about this one, this one's a pretty cool kit. Might not want it in those straight up Gundam colors. Repaint that in some more military type of colors. This thing look badass. So I think that's a good pick right there. That might be the sleeper kit. Got a couple of these little Bam Presto uh, DBZ figures, statues. Got some Figmas in, Kirito, and uh, Guts. Really nice Guts. Fortunately. They're pretty dark and hard to see in these boxes, but get a couple heads here. So, Berserk fans, not too many chances of stuff like this, so grab these. Berserk doesn't get that much uh, figure of love, but uh, when they're out there, get them. On the other hand, Sword, out, Sword Art gets all the love, so... This is from the uh, movie, the movie version with this huge sword he's got. And then we have some Nendroids. So you got Ed, Full Metal Alchemist. If you guys didn't watch that Netflix uh, live action, it was pretty good. Check that out. And Mercy. Very nice looking. I really like how they did this tan. It's a very nice color. That off white she's wearing. So that's always a good pick for you video game fans out there. Overwatch fans. I didn't even see this face for Ed. <laughs> it's hilarious. Somewhere down there. There we go. And my miniature gamers. Got the tanks back in. Got some nice uh, dice for you D&D &D guys and RPG guys. A little arrangement of good brushes and cheap brushes. A little starter kit. Bold action. Need some bold action players here. Got a couple guys already, but we need some more so we can get some good games going. Warhammer. Been uh, getting pretty busy with that. Gonna have to set up uh, some games for that too. Need you guys coming in and play some Warhammer. You guys been buying it. Let's get in here and play. Wednesday night's game night. Of course, Flames of War is always strong here. Got some more of the new Italian stuff. I think there's some more releasing next week. Another big news in Flames of War. Finally, after all this time, the new mat came out. They made this last year. They didn't like it. It was pretty badly made, so they had to uh, cut it. And it took a whole year to get another uh, company to make them for them. But double-sided. Nice, like, uh, mouse material. Mouse pad material. I really like the sand side. Grass is a little bright. It actually looks a lot darker in this uh, video. But uh, still nice. Love it. Great to have a two-sided mat. And some new uh, books from Battlefront. So Avante's for the... Uh, this is actually the newest one for the Italians. Got some Team Yankee books. 
So definitely if you ever thought about getting into Flames of War, check us out on Wednesdays. And all my Gundam guys, look out next week for much bigger uh, shipments. So, And of course, Saturday, Gumpel Potluck, 5 to 8. We usually end up staying a lot later. And other big news next week is Star Wars Legions comes out. So look for more information on that. Uh, I think we're going to be doing some release stuff either Friday or Saturday. i got to put that together for you. Uh, if it's Saturday, it'll be in the morning. If it's Friday, it'll be at night. All right, I'll talk to you guys later. Peace.